Welcome back to my channel, the freshest guy up in town. Welcome back to my channel, thanks for sticking around. Man, fuck all this walking shit. Fucking hiking, I ain't, I don't know why I fucking let their fucking Polly Pocket asses fucking tell me. Oh, Jack, let's go for a fucking walk. Man, fuck it, I'm fucking leaving. Y'all fucking tell me I'm going for a walk. Y'all fucking tell me I'm going for a walk. I ain't going fucking nowhere, dude. What's up guys, welcome back for day two of our trip. Today we're going to the Rock Cave, Petty Dreams grave site. God damn it, Pam. I'm sorry. The Rock Cave. You want me to do it? No. We're going to the Rock House Cave. What's up guys, welcome back for day two. Today we're going to the Rock House Cave, Petty Dreams grave site, and the Cedar Falls Overlook. This little dude. Y'all do what I want. Oh hell yeah, dude! There's a little squirrel dude out there. Some little squirrel dudes. We got a bunch of stuff here. I'm just gonna start like right here. Here is topographical map of where, where, where we are. We are staying right about right about here. Little, come on. Why? You're gonna fall your ass straight down there. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, right, so the legend has it that here is the gravesite of Petty Jean, uh, Little John in French, I guess. But basically, she, her fiance was going on a journey to Arkansas to explore, and she wanted to come, but he said no, of course, because women weren't allowed back then to get on ships. So uh, she disguised herself as a little boy, cut her hair, all this stuff, and named herself Little John. Petty Jean, uh, what the mountain's name after. She ended up getting sick and requested to be buried here. Supposedly, it could be an empty grave for all we know. But that's the legend. I like my description better. Yeah. Man, do you guys feel enchanted? No, apparently this bitch haunts this place. Do you feel enchanted? A little bit. I think it's just the heat. Yeah. It's the wind. Oh, I kinda gotta take a shit too. What about you? No. Oh. I'm just hot. I'm ready to roll over and die. Lay you ready to go get some ice cream? Lay next to Petty Jean. Hold on. <laughs> Selfie with Petty Jean. <laughs> Selfie with Petty Jean. <laughs> oh, let's go. Fuck you. Some of them are really wet. Okay, so me and Jacob on the second, <laughs> the second part of this uh, trail. This is the next day. We've seen the waterfall. Um, okay, the you go straight across a rickety old bridge. You can turn right to the waterfall or left. Me and Jacob turned left. Look at the size of that guy. Yeah. He landed on you. So ah! we, let's catch it and put it in uh put cook it. Yeah. We'll make some fucking <laughs> make some bug burgers. <laughs> Buggers. <laughs> Kenna, you got it the rest of the way? No. Just uh you said yeah? No. Just bring them uh just bring them in when they're done, okay? Kenna's gonna get him. <laughs> Kill said to leave him. He's good, baby. Look, I'll take my chance with with with, with Mad Cow. <laughs> Wait, Jake, we gotta do a recap. 
A recap of the day. All right. Me and Jacob went on a trail, didn't make it. I'll be, I'll be the narrator this, this recap. Okay. So this dude right here. I should never let his Polly Pocket look and sell. <laughs> Talk me into going on a hike. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Yeah. Yeah. You get your, you get your just deserved right now, dude. Yeah, that's that's my recap. We went swimming. What? Oh, oh, snap! Look at that. Can I uh, bring them in when they're done? motivation to search even harder on the missing person's case as I get called on. The first was a little boy who was out berry picking with his parents. He and his sister were together and both of them went missing around the same time. The parents lost sight of them for a few seconds and in that time both the kids apparently wandered off. When the parents couldn't find them, they called us and we came out to search the area. We found the daughter pretty quickly and we asked where her brother was. She told us that he'd been taken away by the bear man. She said he gave her berries and told her to be quiet, and he wanted to play with her brother for a while. The last she saw of her brother, he was riding on the shoulder of the bear man, and seemed, and seemed calm. Of course, our first spot was abduction, but we never found a trace of another human, human being in the area. The little girl was also insistent that he wasn't a normal man, but he was tall and covered in hair, like a bear, and that he had a weird face. We searched the area for weeks. It was one of the longest calls I've ever been on, but we never found a single person that kid. I have to fart. Bradley, I'm sorry. Okay, so legend has it. This is Morlton, Arkansas. Very, very beautiful. Um, Petty June Mountain, come check it out. It's pretty cheap. It's got a lot of stuff you can do here. But anyway, there's a legend. I decided to come out this late because there's a legend of a mountain lion man. Basically, the search and rescue team, they are responsible for going and getting lost. Uh, visitors who get stranded out here. Um, basically, one there was a group of about five people, and they went out to search for a mountain lion because they heard uh, uh, mountain lion screams, which basically sounds because they heard mountain lion calls, which I guess supposedly kind of sounds like a woman screaming. So, uh, so this group of five went down to look for it. One guy got separated. He ended up hearing the scream, so he went a little bit closer, went towards the sound so he could try to uh, get a better, um, a more accurate location of where the territory would have been. And, he ended, and the screams ended up getting closer and closer. So he turned around and uh, ran. And basically he got to where that sign is right now. And he turned around and looked and he seen what looked like a man's figure and it took a big lunge at him and just started running after him so he ran up here you can't see it now but let me turn on the flash so he ran up here and back on this trail all the way up back to the lodge and he's never heard of, heard the sound again supposedly nobody else has heard the sound but I was hoping I could see Mountain Lion Man. I wanted Jacob and Canada to come. They're freaking punks. And I ain't going no further. Nope.